Look at your girl being grown and everything. Girl, she paying bills. Okay. She's journaling. <laughs> She's journaling. She's shadow working. She's eating healthy. Okay. She's working out. All right. She is um, um, being positive on a daily basis. She's an adult. Is Ashley Lachey back with another video? Okay. <laughs> anyway, welcome back to Diary of a Bashful Girl. And I'm just sitting on the couch. It's Friday. Mm, we well, almost said March, April 2nd. Yeah, April 2nd. And it's Friday. TGI off. Okay. And uh, I got off work early. I'm off work early. And uh, I'm trying to decide what I'm going to do tonight if I do anything. But I don't know. It's been a while. I figured I'd get on here and chit chat with y'all a little bit. You know what I'm saying? I, um, I don't know. I feel like I'm in like a weird weird space in my life right now any of you guys feeling that and it's hard to explain i've been trying i've been sitting here on this couch for the last 20 minutes trying to figure out how to word how i'm feeling and also to figure out how i'm feeling you know i it's been a lot of changes um I'm in a new space. I'm in a new, a new apartment. And I feel like I've been kind of 50 yard dashing through life over the last couple months. And now things are kind of like slowing down. And um, the how do I explain this? I felt like I was running for so long. Now I'm slowing down. And the sh some of the stress of all that change is like hitting me. And then also, I don't know, I feel like I'm kind of, I'm, well, you know, we're forever evolving. You're always evolving every day. But I feel like I am outgrowing certain situations, people, and man. It's tough. And uh, one thing about getting older, like you and my mom used to always, my mom, my siblings used to always say this, you know, once you, once you get out of school, it's going to be hard to keep, you know, keep friends, keep, keep people around. And it's not all about um, falling out with people or, um, you know, having tumultuous relationships, but you just, like I said, you outgrow situations, you outgrow people, people move away, you know, things just change. People really start to live their lives and um, you change and you don't even realize that you've changed mentally. And it's very hard to find like-minded people because I don't know, I'm pretty chill, you know what I'm saying? I'm pretty, I'm pretty chill girl. <laughs> and um, I'm pretty chill, pretty quiet, um, if I don't know you. And um, I don't know, I just feel so unentertained. I feel so unentertained with life right now. <laughs> I'm happy, don't get me wrong, but I just feel like nothing's entertaining me. Nothing is, um, everything just seems superficial. Everything just seems cruel, painful, 
it's just a lot going on in the world and I just uh I'm just not here for it <laughs> at all you know what I'm saying <laughs> No, I don't know. I really don't really know how to explain this. Um, but um, I don't know. I just feel like I'm trying to find something, but I don't know what it is. And then on another note, I was um, on the way home today. I was just thinking, I wish everybody wasn't so concerned about being cool and looking cool and doing cool things and saying cool things and me included you know everybody kind of wants to be mysterious and like aesthetically pleasing <laughs> and all these things and sometimes it can all it can be too much you know it just just <sighs> there's certain things i want to say there's certain things i want to do and you know i don't want to say that i'm afraid because i'm not really the type of person to necessarily be afraid or to be scared you know about certain doing certain things but i'm trying to say something without saying it <laughs> there's certain things i want to say certain things i want to share with people feelings i want to tell certain people but the fear of being look being looked at as not cool or being looked at as like girl bye you know keeps me up at night <laughs> so i don't know how y'all doing I'm doing all right. I had started a vlog like um, in January and I had some footage, but it, the footage is kind of irrelevant now, but I might add it to this little video. But anyway, I guess I keep looking at the viewfinder or whatever. Um, I guess I'll talk to y'all later. Um, I think I might do something tonight. And if I do it, I'll be doing it by myself. Which sucks in a way, but it doesn't suck. That's another thing too. I'm discovering that in life. If you want to do something, you can't wait, you can't wait around for other people. You can't. If you want to do something, just damn it, do it. And uh, I think a part of me, too, is just kind of uh, in rediscovering how to enjoy my own company. So, so yeah. Anyway, guys. <laughs> I guess I'll talk to y'all later. All right, let me move this back. So I decided to put my hair up because, in preparation of working out, but also because my hair is just so dry. I swear, I wash my hair and put gel in it and get it, you know, small. <laughs> and then as the days pass, my hair just gets bigger and bigger and bigger. Y'all know the struggle. Team natural, y'all know the dang struggle. I need me a protective style. It's time. Anyway, so let me show y'all these shirts. But first, they hooked your girl up with some cute puns in the package, in the New York and Company package. So the first little thing I got, has anybody ever used these? I know y'all see these in packages. This is this uh, $100 wine voucher from Naked Wines. And I'm like, y'all ain't finna give me no hundred dollars worth of wine. The lies you tell. But I shall look. I shall discover and find out. Because if they do, then I'm going ham. Because I have two of these. So I have another one of these. So I got that. 
And then they gave me a little $100 off um, Green Chef subscription. Y'all ain't gonna steal my stuff. Code not detected. Okay. So, definitely gonna use that. Anyway, let me show y'all my shirts though. So, the first shirt that I got. I got to replace this shirt because I really like this shirt, but it's just, it's kind of falling apart. It was not really falling apart. It's, it's together, it's seamed, but this area here is just kind of ripping a little bit, which I'm sure I can sew it up or whatever, but I don't know. Who got time to sew? Okay, mama, help me. Sew my stuff for me. Um, But yeah, it's kind of the same pattern. And it's this cute shirt here. It's, it's well made. Yeah. So, yeah, this is cute. You got a little tie here and everything like that. You can tie however you want to tie. It. But I got this in a small, tall. Thank you. See, New York and Company. Us tall girls be out here struggling trying to find shirts like this shirt here. Look, I had to roll this sleeve up because. That's as far as it goes. It's supposed to be long. It's supposed to go all the way down. So I have to like roll it up. The struggle is absolutely real. It's certified. Yeah, I got this small tall. It's cute. I'm gonna wear this tomorrow. I got that. And then I got this shirt here. I actually have a shirt like this, another shirt from Shein, but it's green and it's falling apart. Not, I love Shein though, but some stuff you get, you be like, who sold this? Who sold it? Cause um, they didn't do that good of a job. But I got this shirt. So it has like a little turtleneckish situation with the tie. I think this is, I think shirts like this are just so elegant. You know what I mean? So classy, you know, so bougie. Let me stop. Yeah, it has these little cute little sleeves. So this should fit me pretty good if it's a tall, tall, small. Number two. And then the last shirt I got is this. I got this in a small, tall as well. And I'm trying to get some color because I wear a lot of black because black is just so easy. It's just so, you can't go wrong in black when it comes to like work. I love color outside of work, but when it comes to work, I don't know. Anyway, I got this shirt. It's just a little simple, kind of cap sleeve, sort of, kind of cap sleeve. Little tunic type of shirt. And I got this in a small as well, like I said. So yeah, that's what I got. Anyway. Um, I think I'm probably going to eat. I have some, um, a taco that I had got from Jimmy Hula's last night. So I think I might warm that up and eat that. But I also wanted to tell y'all that I, um, was just kind of thinking on the way home today and I was just, um, in my mind, <laughs> you know, in my mind, in my, in my mental. And I, I feel like I'm in a mental limbo on the verge of a mental breakthrough, if that makes any sense. I don't know. I really can't explain it. I feel like I'm rediscovering myself. I'm um, tapping into my beliefs and things like that because they've changed. And um, you know how you, you, you get so used to being one, one person. <laughs> oh, that doesn't right, sounds kind of crazy, but you know you get used to being this person and you're like, this is who I am. This is who I am. But you evolve and you change. And I definitely have changed. So I'm trying to um, assess that and confirm that and concrete that information into my mind. Into my mind. Um, I feel like I'm doing inventory in my mind. I don't know if that makes any sense. And just kind of going through everything, going through my thoughts and my actions and um I plan on doing some shadow work this week 
which means you kind of sit back and, and uh, assess the dark side of yourself because you know we all get so used to um, professing that we're these wonderful people all the time when we're not you know so I kind of want to tap into those negative uh, aspects of myself so that I'm aware of them if they come out and I have more control over and just how far they come out, if that makes sense. So, look at your girl being grown and everything. Girl, she paying bills. Okay. She's journaling. <laughs> She's journaling. She's shadow working. She's eating healthy. Okay. She's working out. All right. She is um, um, being positive on a daily basis. She's an adult. She's an adult. Oh, yes, that's what we do in 2021. Anyway, I'm warm up this food. <laughs> Stop acting in a fool and warm up my food, okay? Picture of the plant that you have, let them know what plant kind of plant you have, and it lets you know how to care for them. And it gives you alerts for when to water it, blah 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 blah. So this is a look at the little tag. to show you guys the shirt one of the shirts so this is the shirt that i got from new york and company and then i just paired it with these pants that i got from mango and i got these little shoes from h and m or whatever and i'm going to head to work so i'll talk to y'all later <laughs>